So another twist that just happened and just occurred. Uh, I was going to make a video on this today. So now with the situation that's happening, Alexander Us is going to be uh, stripped of his belt within the next couple of weeks, two weeks before June 1st, I will see. And um, it looks like that the belt that's going to be on the line, the IBF belt from Usyk, will be on the line for the Dubois and Hergovic fight. And um, the winner of that fight will most likely uh, fight Joshua, from what I'm hearing. But it is what it is that happens sometimes. It definitely is a situation. But from what I'm seeing overall, um, with Usyk getting his belt stripped, um, really no reason to have undisputed at this point. Uh, unless IBF had something lined up already. I don't know. Maybe they didn't know about the rehydration clause or anything that's been going on, but... They've been making a lot of moves and doing a lot of different things lately. So people just trying to figure out what's going on. But it looks like Joshua will have a chance to get that belt uh, with the fight against one of these guys within the next couple of months. Uh, definitely a, a, a new situation that just popped up. It hasn't been something that's been going on. Uh, definitely different. Uh, shocking to me. I'm very surprised. Yeah, I don't know about everybody else, but I'm very surprised in this situation. Didn't think that Usu would get stripped this quick. Uh, it's the second second time that a guy's gotten stripped weeks after uh, getting undisputed. So uh, definitely not a good situation to have. Uh, I don't know what's uh, the movement about, but. We'll find out eventually over the next couple of days. But uh, this is being reported all over the place. Uh, it's just different right now. I don't understand. You know what I'm saying? This is this is definitely a different situation. This is not something that's uh, everybody's been looking at. But for him to be getting stripped in this situation, it changes a lot of things. Definitely been a lot of work going on. But... It's a different situation. I like what they bring to the table right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm def I definitely like what's what's going on. I like the movement. But uh it, it's changing things. It's changing things. I don't know what is this gonna do now. So is Joshua gonna turn around and fight Usyk down the line? I heard they're trying to fight uh line up a uh fight with uh yeah, uh, I, I'll talk talk more about that during my live. I was going to explain a little bit about this, but this has turned into a whole other situation. Because now we're talking about Joshua getting the belt again. With Joshua now in a position to get a belt, it changes a lot, so it's a lot to keep up with. This is definitely something new uh, that just popped up, haven't been going on. Nobody was really aware of this that I know of, you know, I didn't have this piece of information. I knew it was certain things that was going on. I had this thought about a couple of months ago. But at this time right now, I don't really have that thought as far as really knowing the ins and outs of everything. But I definitely, uh, I'm definitely surprised overall, man. Like, this happens very quick. For Usa to kind of uh, get this belt, and then for Joshua to kind of still be in the picture, for that belt and um, a lot of other things too, but for Dubois and Hergovic, uh, it's a good situation for them. But it's kind of weird. You, were, in my mind, I would think that somebody, somebody like Parker would be more in line to get the belt, or that's why I was thinking in my mind, why, why don't Parker fight, uh, Hergovic? You know, I had been saying that, but you know. People argue about how Parker and her, uh, Hergovic are top five, but they don't want to see them fight each other. That doesn't make any sense. So, you know what I'm saying? As far as me, it doesn't make any sense at all. Like, make it make sense. But, yeah, it's definitely a situation. Definitely a good situation. I like the fight, man.
Very good fight. And now it shows you that only one one fight can change everything. I don't think people really thought about all this going into the uh, fight as much as I have. I don't think because I know people say, yeah, yeah, I gave Usyk a chance. I mean, it don't sound like it. You know what I'm saying? It don't sound like they really gave him a chance because now we're in a situation where everything is happening and people don't really know the options. But it's going to switch around very soon, though. It's going to switch around very soon. But I definitely think this was a uh, good situation for uh, Usyk to be in. Hurry up and get that undisputed out of the way. But how many other belts, what directions are these belts going to go to? Is all I'm asking. But I, I'll get to, into it more later on. But uh, definitely all, all I'm going to report. He's definitely going to be stripped in the next two weeks. Uh, Daniel Dubois, uh, Hergovic going to have a chance for the belt. Lining up a fight with Joshua. And that's the picture right now that's, that can happen. So that's all I got.